Tone and Mood Tone and mood are both elements which the author applies in any literary piece he's writing. Deal with emotions and they're used to engross or take the undivided attention of the readers. Let's now differentiate the tone and the mood. Tone shows the feeling of the author towards a character's action. On the other hand, mood forces the reader to be in a certain situation, feel deeply, and have a standpoint on what the character is experiencing. Tone presents the author's thought or judgment on the decision made by a certain character in the story. While mood appeals to the senses of the readers through the author's excellent use of language. Tone is a direct statement of the author revealing how he sees a character's response on a particular situation. On the other hand, Mood is a plain description of what is the character doing and feeling in a particular situation. Lastly, tone may or may not affect the reader's opinion about how the character decides and acts in the story. While mood is solely based on the reader's emotions upon reading a passage in the story. The examples of tone words are hurt, suspicious, encouraging, disappointed, depressed, lighthearted, apathetic, soothing, and candid. While the words under mood are mournful, horrific, gloomy, melancholic, powerful, optimistic, eerie, threatening, and calm. Examples of passages Undertone This laptop is no longer efficient. It has a lot of scratches and virus. But since it's my mother's gift to me on my 21st birthday, I still use and keep it for it has a special place in my heart. The tone is sentimental. Under mood, a person who suddenly paused for 10 seconds in the backyard after seeing a snake is shocked. Another passage under tone. The apartment we are renting needs repair, but we opt to stay because we believe that the landlord will be making improvements and refurbishments sometime soon. The tone is optimistic. The next mood passage is A student who fidgets a lot during the afternoon class discussion is bored. The last tone passage is If my father did not leave us when we were young, we should have a more comfortable life. The tone is bitter. And the last mood passage is a man who clenches his fist after seeing his wife with another man at the coffee shop is angry. Always bear in mind that tone is the author's personal emotion or opinion in his writing. On the other hand, mood is the emotion felt by the reader while and after reading a passage or selection through the author's excellent use of language. Thank you for watching!